guys welcome back let's get into this week's photo memory i'm using the collection called the charm life as well as this one right here called for the record by Lori whitlock i threw these collections together because they were somewhat similar a couple of other stickers letters and some puffy stickers that i didn't end up using um anyways uh, foam stickers that is so let's get into this week lining up the pictures of kind of what happened chronologically and the reason I picked these colors is because I thought they resonated really well with the colors in the pictures this collection yeah so let's get into kind of what happened this week or what happened this past week um so my son and I have been spending a lot of time together he I said last week or a couple weeks ago he has uh, dermatology therapies and stuff, and on this specific day, he was having a hard time with it. I mean, I know what it's like to be a teenage girl, but I don't know what it's like to be a teenage boy and what they go through, but he's been pretty much open with me, and on this specific day, we had a great talk about his future and what he, how he plans to keep up with his skin therapy and what he wants to get out of it. It's such a hard time to tell. I was having a hard time telling him, like, put lotion on, drink some water, and, you know, take some meds and stuff like that. But um, it was a really great talk that we had, me and him. Um, I really am appreciative of how, how open he is about talking with me about certain things and that he is um, trusting me and um, confiding in me on certain things like that. And so with that, he's been into um, cooking lately and he decided he wanted to do the recipe from the movie. Uh, he wanted to do the ratatouille recipe and he looked it up and it was so great because he was in the kitchen and he was cooking and he had the Disney movie playing in the background and he had um, the, the music, French music going on. It was really nice to see him kind of, you know, do that on his own and pick out his recipe and then on this day, my husband, he, oh my gosh. So my son does baseball stuff and my daughter does cheer stuff. And sometimes it, by the time he comes home, two seconds later, I have to go pick them up. And I'm in the middle of cooking or something. So he'll go and he'll do me the favor of picking them up. And the kids like it when dad comes and picks them up. They get a, they just yell at him and be like, hey, daddy. And they get all excited. And the dog loves going. That's one of the things, like, he knows he gets a ride with dad. So that was pretty fun. And then towards the end of the week, um, Daisy, she has been, it's the end of semester here. And she was looking up her grades and look, picking new classes that she wanted. And she was just super excited. And she kind of got an email from um, a couple of teachers saying how they are so impressed with her. And just her her overall grading and how how independent she is and stuff so that was really great and then towards the end of the week man they are mowing the lawns and doing gardening out here sorry my daughter um decided that we should have just like a family weekend together where we have comfort food and yummy delicious um little you know just kind of at home and be comfy and cozy it has been raining foggy drizzling here in oregon so we did kind of a comfort food, comfort Mexican food here. We had a pot of beans going on and we added all the fixings and we had really delicious kind of movie night recharging from the whole week. We had practices for baseball, cheer, uh, late night, my husband coming home from work sometimes. And so it was nice to just not do nothing this past weekend. And it was fun. It was it was a recharging that we needed. We came up with some funny jokes. We have a lot of inside family jokes and we do movie quoting and stuff. And it was just, it was a good weekend. This past weekend was great. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and checking it out and see you next week. Bye.